and our trailer is wow we're 79.5 welcome back to the hurry up and wait simulator we are here in glorious saint joseph missouri and we are going to do a lowe's run we're going to pick up at a lowe's distribution center and we're going to deliver to a lowe's store these Lowe's distribution loads are generally just a bunch of random stuff. We're going to have lumber, we're going to have insulation, we're going to have PVC pipe, ladders, and whatever the hell they can fit on a flatbed truck. Let's get at it, let's go, and load, and do stuff, and do trucker things, and be productive. Yeah, I think. I don't know. Okay, we are here at the Lowe's Distribution Center. And we just checked in, and our load is preloaded, which is nice. It just means three quarters the amount of work for me. Actually, it means I'm gonna have to do a little bit more because it's already tarped and it has some straps on it, but I'm gonna have to peek up underneath the straps and see what is there and what is secured and what I gotta fix. So that's what we gotta do. Take us one of them there trucker showers. Ew. I always carry Huggies Natural Care baby wipes because they are strong enough to get the doo doo off a baby's backside, but gentle enough for all of my trucker bits. And they will take fifth wheel grease off. They're amazing. Let's go get checked out and get our paperwork. Okay, let's see what we weigh. Theaters are forty one, so forty one minus forty one three twenty, so twenty nine two eighty, mm -hmm. and our trailer is wow, we're seventy nine five. We are so close. Trailer is 38,180, which is legal for us. We're allowed up to 40 back there. But, wow. I guess this load does weigh 47,000 pounds. Who would have thunk it? Okay, let me go get my paperwork. It's so hot out there. I swear it went up 30 degrees in the last. 
two hours, three hours. Okay, we are done. We are good. We are out of here. Let's go make some money. And maybe find a place for a quick shower. The goal is to get a shower and then we are going to go to Lowe's and park in their parking lot so that we are ready, good to go as soon as they open in the morning. Which is, I think they start receiving at 7 a.m. So that's our plan. Break, let's go. We are done. We are at our delivery. Our appointment is in 10 hours, roughly, give or take 20 minutes. So we are home for the night and I do believe this is going to be hopefully a decent night. I don't foresee any wind in the weather or really cold temperatures in the morning. Hopefully I'm not bundled up like an overstuffed turkey when we try to deliver tomorrow. So I'm going to go to bed and I wish you all the best and I will see you all in the morning. Night night. Good morning. I think it's 5.30. He just came and knocked on my door to go get me set up. God, Lord. Oh, he's going to get up soon anyway and go around and do it anyway. But... You want me to get up and do it anyway now, so... Let's go get untarped and get unloaded.
That was close. But we made it. Everything's fine. No accidents. <sighs> but unfortunately, by the time I got back out to the truck, the dude who was unloading me was almost done. So I needed to hurry up and get the tarps rolled up and the straps rolled up and put away because there was their truck, their local flatbed was trying to get past me. And there was another system truck that was going to deliver potting soil, I believe, who needed to get by. And I was just in the way. But that's where they wanted me to unload. So yeah, I had to hurry up and get that done. Other than that, we're done. We're empty. We are now playing hurry up and wait. I gotta wait here for about 30 minutes before I can go. That being said, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you wanna see more, subscribe. If you liked it, like it. And what's that last one? Oh yeah, questions, comments, concerns, rude remarks, ideas on how to stop myself from myself then uh, leave them in the comments below. Other than that, I hope you all have a good day, a good weekend, and remember, wipe front to back. Bye, everyone.